And now time for the morning rush. The father of Peyton Washington says the elite Texas cheerleader is now in stable condition. The head coach of the Baylor acrobatics and tumbling team says she's making good progress, but there's still a long way to go. Washington was shot outside of an HEB after mistakenly getting into the wrong car. In Texas prior to 1980, you quite likely saw copies of the Ten Commandments uh, because of their moral code their place in history and their place in American and Western law. The state Senate approved a bill that would require public and charter schools to set aside time to pray and read the Bible during school. It's one of the latest attempts to incorporate religion into public schools from Texas Republicans. Opposers of the bill say concerns include taxpayer money being used to buy religious texts. It will now go to the house. And the company who owns Narcon plans to the opioid reversal medicine at less than fifty dollars for those for two doses. This is less than its current listed price at around one hundred and thirty dollars. The FDA approved Narcan for over the counter use in February. Narcan will be available without a prescription later this year. Well, it is time to look into the sky again. This time for the Lee Ridge meteor shower. The fast and bright meteors happen every year in April when Earth passes th through debris from comets. NASA says the shower will peak today, April 21st and Saturday. And the best time to watch is at 9 p.m. And that is your morning rush.